in Section 40 by striking out lines 33 to 37, and setting in place of the following. Section 12-O. If an abortion is performed pursuant to Section 12 and the facility... There be no objection. The will dispense with the reading of the paper. The chair has done. Question now on the amendment. The chair recognizes Mr. Lombardo of Billabrick. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, th this amendment seeks to restore the current law regarding live births. We're asking the House today to reinstate language that requires the physician performing the abortion to use life-saving measures to preserve the life and health of a live birth and for the patient. Colleagues, this amendment isn't about being pro-abortion or against abortion. This amendment doesn't change if you can get an abortion, who can get an abortion, or at what age you can get an abortion. So I appeal to my pro-choice colleagues to give serious consideration to the ask in this amendment. This amendment does not uh, apply to what some call a fetus or a clump of cells in a mother's womb. This amendment refers to a baby born alive having survived an abortion attempt. We're talking about a human being outside of the womb. This amendment would reinstate our current law that if a baby is born, the doctor is required to provide health care. My friends, who can possibly be against this? Who among them doesn't believe that a child out of the womb should receive medical care? Who among us believes that innocent babies should be left on a table to die? This is a fundamental question about what type of society we are going to be. We are a society that has determined that health care is so fundamentally important as a civilized people that we give health care to criminals who shoot police officers and may be harmed. If we require that we give health care to terrorists like the Marathon Bombers, should we not apply the same standard of health care for innocent babies born alive? Colleagues, I'm asking you to support this amendment. I'm asking you to restore the current language of the law today. This vote doesn't make you less pro-choice. It ensures that we are a civilized society. Allowing babies born alive to die without health care is barbaric, and we are better than that in Massachusetts. I ask that when a vote be taken, it, it be taken by call of the A's and A's. Some battle of Gilbert asked when the matter is taken, be taken by call of the A's and A's. Those joining with them will rise. Monitors, turn the count.